came in at the start of block three, so the start of 2012, and what a way to kick off the year. We had a couple of days of motion capture. A little bit of that, a little bit of just... Got you. Yeah, yep. Yep. Cool. He wanted to get inside the character. He really wanted to own it. He didn't want to just be a voice artist who came in after the fact and said the words. You get the helmet on, and the helmet has a sort of Madonna-type headset thing, which is actually a camera which comes to here. This camera is really weird because it's right in your face. It's got a little circle of LED lights, so you're, you're literally carrying around the actress's dream. You have your own little private chemo. Mm, it's really nice, but actually it's very, very weird. And then you kind of have to forget it. And imagine yourself into a vast creature in a huge space when you're really crawling around on a grey bit of carpet. Benedict's choices as an actor were definitely going to affect Smaug big time. And I said, treat it like you're playing the role. Don't think you're just providing the voice. Go in there physically, get what you can out of it. There will be head turns, there will be moments from that performance that you give that can be pulled out and extrapolated and will become part of, of Smaug's being. I kill wherever I please, and none can stop me. <laughs>